So uh, again, welcome to today's um, uh, webinar. Uh, my name is Scott Sazen. I'm an account manager here with uh, Moldex 3D Northern America. And uh, today's webinar is going to focus on sick marks uh, in injection molded parts. And uh, we'll take a look at how simulation can be used uh, as a tool to predict uh, this defect and also identify um, uh, potential problem areas uh, before they actually occur. Yeah, so we'll get into it. Um, so in this you know, wonderful world of injection molding, there's a, a variety of defects that uh, could potentially affect a, a molded part. Uh, defects, as you see here, things like short shots, uh, weld lines, part warpage, uh, just to name a few. And uh, depending on the defect, it could be um, a service quality issue or like a cosmetic issue. Uh, it could be more uh, structural or strength related. Uh, and also it could be a, a dimensional issue. Uh, today's focus is going to be on uh, sink marks, which uh, primarily is more of a uh, surface quality issue, um, but depending on the application could, uh, um, could also um, uh, affect obviously dimensions, but today's focus will be on uh, sink marks and simulation. So just some basics. Um, uh, so what is a sink mark? Um, so sink marks are, are defect. They, uh, they appear as um, depressions on the surface of a molded part. Uh, typically, you're going to see it at a, uh, a thicker cross-section of a part, maybe opposite areas um, molded in features such as uh, ribs or bosses. And then um, uh, a similar defect, um, which happens on the inside of the part, a void, uh, are pockets of trapped air uh, that are um, in the cross-section of the part, usually in a, a thick wall section of the part. And uh, th thank you for the new people that are joining. And uh, if I could just make a note to please keep your microphone on mute, it would be appreciated. Thank you. So what causes um, uh, these sink marks and, and voids? Um, so both of them are caused by um, non-uniform cooling and shrinkage of a thick wall section compared to uh, a thinner or nominal wall thickness of a molded part. Uh, sink marks are uh, formed when there's uh, a weaker surface layer and the surface will actually pull inward towards the thicker wall and that forms the depression at the part surface. 